what's up guys this is will and i'm back with another video and today we're going to take a look at the pixel book pen so as you guys know i've had the pixel book for quite a uh quite a while now and i i've never picked up the pixel book pen for this so uh, i didn't want to pay a hundred bucks for it uh that's what it's going for so uh, i i want to bid on ebay for it and i got it for like 70 bucks a little bit over seventy-two dollars, I think, and uh, so that saves me about forty dollars if I buy it out of the store, because you have to add taxes when you're in the store. So uh, it's supposed to be in mint condition, brand new, new in the box. That's what it says. So let's go ahead and get this box open and uh, see what we got here. Uh, let's see, maybe able to pull this out. Get this out of here. Uh, I think the uh, Pixel Pen completes this device. I don't know if it's necessarily, uh, if it's absolutely necessary to have it, but uh, I just I wanted to try it, give it a try, and uh, see what it's like. Also, with this, uh, I did get uh, they did within the bid, so I'll show you right here. Here's the total $72. Uh, also included with this was the little clip that, that you can adhere to the bottom of the uh, pixel book to <laughs> uh, have a place to store your pen. So, uh, but here's the box here, as you can see, pixel book pen. Uh, don't know if I really need it, but I wanted to have this just to complete my, my setup here. As you can see on the side, works with Google Assistant. And then on the back of here, it just tells you uh, what's included. This comes with a with the Pixel Pen and a Quad A battery. So that's going to be interesting to see how that works. So uh, let's get this open. So first thing you're greeted with here is some paperwork. Let's get started. Uh, just tells you how to install install the battery. And it says tap the string, press and hold button to for Google Assistant. So, and then you get your uh, safety warranty information here as well. So, uh, this is, these have been out for a long time. Uh, I've never picked it up before, so this is my first time. Let's see what we got here. Let's see what's in the box. So here's the Quad A battery energizer. From what I understand, they, that should last about a year or you know depends on your use so here's the pen and it's definitely locked in there all right hate to go beast mode getting it out of there but all right so here's the pen initial impressions very lightweight uh maybe because the batter is not in there uh same color almost as the uh pixel book uh this is plastic this is not uh, doesn't have that rubbery feel. Do have a button here, and then just just very light, uh, very light feeling. So, I'm gonna go ahead and unscrew this and get the battery in it. And let's see how the battery goes. I'm gonna put it in like that and see. So the battery does add a little bit of weight to it. Uh, so I'm going to pause it, see if I can get this set up, figure out, and then I'll show you guys how, how I got it set up. Okay, guys. So initially when I got close to the strain, I uh, pushed this button. It prompted me to touch the strain. Uh, after I touched the strain, uh, I'm assuming it was paired because this little icon right here, this pen icon showed up. As you can see, uh, as I touch the string, it brings up a menu here. And this is these are the stylish tools. So you have a, a, a settings uh, menu right here that you can go into. Uh, this tells you you can turn on the stylish tool in the shelf, which is that little uh, icon we saw down there. Uh, you can take uh, have note taking apps right here. Uh, find stylus apps on 
on uh, Google Play. Uh, you can enable taking, enable note takings from Lockstream. That is on. And keep latest note on Lockstream. And that is on. So that's what's in the settings there. Said I'm going to come back after using this for a few days and uh, go over what I think about it. So let's just go in here. So the first thing is ca uh, capture region, which is pretty self-explanatory here. So if I wanted to capture that, it captured it. And uh, you, can cop you can copy this to the clipboard or you can annotate on it. That are your options with that. The next one is capture the stream, which I just did. And it also says show it in a folder. Uh, let's show it in the folder. So here it is here. And that's the stream capture right there. Uh, and I can annotate on that or do different things with that as well. And then the next one down is create a note. So uh, this has 2,000 uh, pressure points. Um, I think that's what it's called. One thing I did notice, there's no extra tips in the box for this. So that's kind of a bummer. And this is the Wacom or Wacom technology. So it should be pretty good. Let's check it out here. And as you can see, it seems to be following my, my pen uh, my stroke very well. Uh, no latency, latency to as I can see. And you do have an option here. Uh, let's go into the menu here. A new drawing, download, delete current drawing. Uh, draw with touch. Trying to read this behind the lights. Uh, so as you can see, I can go into my notes right there. I don't know how I did that. But like I said, I'll come back. And uh, I'll come back and do a, another video after a couple of days or so, a week or so. Uh, but here's some other uh, stuff here. You got square dots, rules, uh, none. So I could change the look of the page. This is like paper right here. So if I wanted to write on this, uh, let me pick something here. Then I could write just like I'm writing on a page. The next one, uh, dots. So you got dots here. And then the next one is squares. So these are your different tips here. So this, as you can see, that makes it a little bit uh, wider stroke. And then you can change your colors here as well. So you can see, that's more like a paintbrush. This one's more like a... Well, I'll see once I start with this. This one's kind of fine right now, as you can see. I guess you can uh, make it a little bit wider as well. And then you got one here. Said I'm not familiar with this at all, guys. So once I do get the hang of it or uh, use it for a few days, then I'll come back and let you know uh, how I'm using it. Uh, the next one is the assistant. So I clicked on that. So let's go into uh, let's go into the web browser. Draw with your stylus. All right. So I'm going to escape that. So let's go to assistant. Go to the web browser here and. I'm going to just circle, uh, let's go into Amazon. Now this should be able to, as you draw around a picture or something, then it, it should, uh, should be able to pull up something. I'll push this little button and I'll just draw around these headphones and see if the assistant will give me uh, some information on that. And it says, I can't find anything on the screen. I can help you try typing, typing, tapping the mic to ask for more, ask me anything. So didn't work on that first try. Uh, let's try again. So I circled that 
I did rec recognize that I circled it, uh, but it's not bringing up anything. I don't know if it's something else I need to be doing with that, but like I said, I, when I come back and tell you about this to, uh, later, then uh, I'll have more information. Next thing is the laser pointer. And I guess this would be great if you have an external uh, display hooked up and you're doing a presentation, then you could use this to point out what you're doing. And then uh, the last thing here is a magnifying glass. Uh, again, we'll go back into the uh, web browser here. Let's go to Amazon again. Well, we'll just use it here. Because I said, I'm very unfamiliar with, with this pen right now. But as you can see, it magnifies everything very well. So, all right, guys. So, that has been my unboxing of the Google Pixelbook pen. Uh, it has a nice weight to it. This is kind of like a, a metal feel right here. This is plastic. And it does... Uh, you know, kind of look like the the color of the pixel book. So uh, another thing here, guys, let's go ahead and put this on. Uh, this is to hold the uh, pen, and this just goes under the bottom. And I got this, they sent this to me with uh, the device, but I've already had one. Uh, if you got a pixel book, you can go to their website and uh, you have to give them the information, like your serial number or something, off your uh, your Pixel Book. I'll go ahead and put this on there, and they will send send you one of these out. But like I said, you have to have some information about your Pixel Book. So there it is. There. Now I don't know if I'm going to use this or not. <laughs> uh, don't know how well it'll stay on there, but let's try it out. So there it is, that's the look right there, guys. Let's pop this open again. So there it is, that's how it looks on there. So I'll probably leave it there, but like I said, uh, I got one that uh, I requested from them, and here it is. So I actually got two of them. And uh, if you got a pixel book, just go to their website. Uh, if I can find the information again, I'll link it down below, but all right, guys, that's a first look at the Google Pixelbook pen. Well, thanks for watching, guys. We'll catch you on the next video. We're out of here.